Hello Leos, welcome to your Twin Flame reading for the month of April. Guys, I had recorded a video of your Twin Flame reading and somehow it got deleted from my camera and it was such a beautiful reading. It was honestly, it was about both you and your person Leo who are healing, who are not willing to, somebody here is not willing to take the risk to, um, to, to get into a relationship they want the commitment they know you're a soulmate they know this that they love you but something was holding them back okay from having this happiness and and for you leo you know you knew that this person is the one um it was such a beautiful reading um but hopefully we can get the same cards again if the angels my angel guides um want this to but it was such a beautiful reading right angel guides of uh, what what do we have for leos please i really wish you guys could have saw that it was absolutely brilliant distant horizon okay what do we have for the person in question please that leo is dealing with what do we need to know for the person in question who leo is dealing with we have courtship Okay. Yeah, there was a lot of fours, a lot of sixes coming up in in the read, and it was absolutely beautiful. Right, um, angel guys, what guidance, what messages can we have for my Leos who are watching this and cross watchers? What do they need to know, please? What guidance, what messages can we have, please? Oh gosh. What messages and what guidance do we have, please? One more card, please, angel guides. What message, what guidance can we have, please? So we have um, your hard work is paying off and we have adjustments are required. Um, in the previous read that got deleted, we had um, you need to let go of your past. OK, so somebody here clearly was holding on to their past. Um, so I really do hope we get the same cards again, Leo's. Let's see what messages we have for you and the person in question. Okay, um, let's see what we have for the person that Leo is dealing with. What messages do we have for the person that Leo is dealing with, please? I really still do believe and feel that there is stuck energy here with this person. They were very conflicted. Um, they were very stressed. Um, we have a flip. Okay, we're going to take that one. And let's get another one for the person in question. Okay, yeah, we have the same card again. Okay, so let's go on to your actual reading, um, Leos, and uh, see what we have for you and the person in question. Oh, gosh. I'll give it one more shuffle. Okay, let's cut the deck. Angel guys, what what messages do we have for Leos and the person they're dealing with for their twin flame reading? We have the four of wands. <laughs> Leos, the four of wands was actually in your person's reading. We have justice. Mm, okay. We have eight of pentacles, we have the five of cups, we have the sun, we have the ace of swords, we had the sun in your person's read as well, and um, the five of cups was in your person. So I feel like the energy is kind of flipped here as well for you and your person. So let's let's go to um 
let's go to your person in question the person that you are dealing with what do we need to know for the person that leo is dealing with please angel guides so we have the six of swords i am luckily we are seeing repetitive cards here so that's that's good um we have the four of cups we have the ten of wands we have the ten of pentacles we have patience which is temperance and we have the five of swords okay what is working well for leos and the person in question please angel guides what is working well for leos and the person in question what is working well for leos and the person in question please what is working well for leos and the person in question what is working well for leos and the person in question We have the lovers, which was actually in what was not working well in the previous read. So interesting. What is working well for Leo's and the person in question? Please, Angel Guides, one more card. We have the messenger, which is the Knight of Swords. What is not working well? Angel guides, what is not working well for Leos and the person in question? What is not working well, please? What is not working well, please, angel guides? We have the fool. One more card, please, angel guides. Thank you very much. We have the Page of Swords. I'm going to turn that back around. I don't need reversals in the main cards. Um, so we have the Page of Swords and the Fool. Okay. Again, there's that guarded energy. Um, at the bottom of the deck, we have Strength, which did come up in your reading, Leos. Um, the Strength here is showing about courage, having the patience and the resilience, okay, um, to, to deal with um, the situation, okay. And I feel that you know that there's a lot of strength in this relationship, okay. The potential for it to work and that is your own energy there leo okay um so leos so leos um what we do have here is um so we have stability we have um because two two is twin flame right so we have stability here we have um stability we have marriage we have commitment okay and with the justice card here i feel that you have um you have clarity on what it is that you want and you want to take this relationship to the next level um i feel here as well that you want to compromise with this person and, and you just want to know what the truth is um for some of you this could also mean legal marriage as well okay this could mean marriage in a courthouse there you have it for there you go okay so for most leos or for a, a collect, collective amount of leos this is the energy here okay um somebody here may be seeing something from um, a distance okay so you you and this person may be at a distance at the moment from each other okay and wanting to get married okay um and have this commitment i also feel here that somebody here may be looking at the bigger picture here okay right um looking towards the future all right um, and that anchor here is also showing that this is um this is something that's holding you both together okay this is what's holding the relationship down um in your current position you have the eight of pentacles and you have the five of cups so with the eight of pentacles i feel that somebody here is really busy okay thinking about somebody all right and with the five of cups here they may be feeling disappointed or at loss or despair okay um with the eight of pentacles the more you think about this person okay um the more you feel at loss or despair without this person okay without this person you feel loss okay because you see this connection as a soul connection you see this person as the one that you want to be with and i feel that with the um eight of pentacles being here and the five of cups um this is showing to me here that you you feel so stressed when you're not with this person you are thinking about this person and you want to be with this person leo okay 
so as the overall outcome you have the sun okay um again a brand new beginning a happy brand new beginning that's scorpionic energy there you have libra's energy there as well um in the previous read i had a lot of earth energy for some of you you could have been dealing with a taurus you could have been dealing with a virgo or a capricorn there was immense um earth energy coming up in this read okay um so with the sun card here i feel that you feel like um there is fun there is warmth there's positivity okay in in this um relationship okay and with the ace of sword you want to have this breakthrough okay you want to have victory you want to have breakthrough with this person okay but what is um really blocking the situation from you having this breakthrough okay and having this um clarity okay is is there's some kind of stress some kind of loss here because you're not with this person right now so moving over to your person we have the six of um swords and we have the four of cups okay so this person here again there's that distance here this person may be wanting to move towards you okay in a calmer situation this person here um see i could read this two ways here okay um leos um and for cross watchers you either are moving away from this person into a calmer situation or you are moving towards this person okay towards this person to be with this person okay and with the four of cups being here i feel again this person is re-evaluating the situation whether they want to make the move or whether they want to stay where they are okay um for a majority or a collective amount of whoever this person is whether this is your energy leo or whether this is your person's energy this person is sitting there and they are thinking about this opportunity which is what i got very strongly in the previous read this person is sitting there they're thinking about having this opportunity they're re-evaluating the situation they may be meditating as well i i had the energy that somebody here may be an empath or a psychic or taking psychic advice or getting um you know a, a tarot reader to um give advice to this person um i feel here that with the four of cups very strongly that this person may miss out on the opportunity and doesn't want to do that okay so um with the ten of wands being here again there's that energy again of stress this person may have a lot of responsibilities this person is stressing themselves out they're burning themselves out but this is coming to an end real soon okay they may be dealing with family issues right now they may be dealing with um, um financial issues okay in regards to disability in their family they may have a family that you know they have a lot of responsibility for and that they care for okay um, and i'm feeling that they're very very stressed right now okay which is making it difficult for them to move into a calmer situation and that is why they are sitting there and thinking about the possibility of having this um ten of pentacles okay for their outcome they have the temperance you could be dealing with a sag here as well okay um, and we have the five of swords okay so with the five of swords and the temperance being here okay this person again there's that conflicted energy this person is really conflicted but they want to win at any cost okay and i feel here that with the five of swords being here they are in so much tension that right now they feel at loss okay with every with the situation that's going on right now and they're being guided it's a karmic situation they are being guided right now okay to work through these challenges and to get the balance that they need and to put their feet in one place okay on a solid grounded foundation okay leos let's go ahead and clarify this reading let's clarify the reading please for leo summary rising venus angel guys please clarify the four of ones please Clarify the Four of Wands, please. Why is the Four of Wands here? Why is the Four of Wands here, please? Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay, so we have the Knight of Pentacles and we have the Two of Wands. Yes. Um, okay, so with the Two of Wands, okay, I feel that um, somebody here has come to the realization, okay, of how much they really want to take this uh, relationship onto in the next level, which is of commitment, a very strong commitment um, energy here. Because the Knight of Pentacles is a slow moving energy, okay. The Knight of Pentacles here is a very grounded energy, okay. The Knight of Pentacles is somebody who has um, a method, method, I can never say that word, <laughs> methodical. Um, I think I might have said that wrong, okay, um, but um, 
has a very traditional outlook okay on life and he's a very grounded energy and when he comes he stays for a long time okay, okay. and i think that with the knight of pentacles being here somebody here wants to move forward okay somebody here um really wants to progress okay and um is having the courage and making the decision to progress okay towards a um a very stable amount of commitment the two of wands in the previous reading also was showing here that somebody is um actually coming to the realization okay of how much they really want this okay and they really have this person on their mind um why is the justice here please angel guides why is the justice here why is the justice here six of wands yes um you see here somebody may be traveling to this person to come and see this person as well okay but with the justice card here somebody here feels like this person is is, is somebody who can complete them this is a completion this person makes you feel complete okay leo um this person you want to progress more with this person you want to move forward successfully with this person okay you want to um have uh, gain victory okay over this relationship you want to have an outcome a successful outcome okay um in this relationship and i feel here that with the justice card you're going to get a breakthrough and you want to do what is right okay um you want a win-win solution you want to come to some sort of compromise with this person Okay, let's clarify this Eight of Pentacles. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here, please, Angel Guides? Why is the Eight of Pentacles here, please? Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? We have the Five of Swords and the Five of Cups. There may be some conflict at the moment, okay? Um, and I feel that, Leo, this could be within your own mind or whoever this person is, that somebody here is very, very conflicted at the moment, okay? And and somebody here as well is, is contemplating and really thinking about this person. All right, Leo, so whether this is you or this is your person, somebody here is so busy thinking about this person, they can't get them off their mind, okay? And they're very much conflicted. But I feel that there is stubbornness on both sides here because um, you both want to win. You both want to win, okay? You both want to gain victory over the situation. But this is, the only difference is, this is your current energy and this is the person's outcome. Let's clarify the Five of Cups. In regards, why is the Five of Cups here, please? You have Five of Cups. See that again. You're both contemplating. You're both thinking. Clarify the Five of Cups, please, Angel Guides. Clarify the Five of Cups, please. Okay, so you have the Justice and you have the Nine of Pentacles. Yes, again, there's that same energy again. Um, this is about somebody here speaking very clearly, okay, with a lot of clarity, okay, about what they stand for, what they believe, okay, and their independence, okay, and how important it is to them. And now somebody here is sitting and thinking about this, okay? So there could have been a conversation that happened between you and this person here, okay, um, where there was um, truth spoken, okay, and there was clarity and there was compromise coming in the situation here um, about what this person what this person believes in what they stand up for okay about their own self-worth okay clarify the sun please angel guides yeah. okay so we have the um knight of cups okay we have the four of wands and we have the four of cups again there it is i feel that somebody may have felt a loss here um or disappointed because they wanted this relationship they know that this is their person that they love um but i feel that because of the distance there's this loss there's this feeling of loss um even though they know that that two of cups is there but um i feel that perhaps somebody has turned their back on this connection because of their independence because of what they believe and what they stand up for um okay so with your overall outcome you have the sun card here with the knight of cups and the four of wands with the four of cups okay so a lot of four energy here okay 
and this is all about foundation here so with the nine of cups i feel that somebody here um wants to come forward and make an offer okay somebody here is holding that ace of cups somebody here it may not be as as big as the ace of cups but this is definitely um somebody here making a a proposition okay somebody here making an offer okay in a emotional loving way and with the four of wands i think somebody here is about to get down on one knee that's what i feel here with the four of cups okay i think that with the four of cups here somebody here may end up stopping though okay something might be said that will make this person stop before they even try to um even make this offer or before they even reach to this that position of getting down on one knee okay somebody here may reevaluate the situation and think can i actually do this whether this is nervousness or whether this is um somebody saying something or your person saying something to you okay in regards to the situation but um leo i don't think it's you i think that you have the confidence to do this and i think that you're ready to do this clarify the ace of swords please angel guards clarify the ace of swords so we have the five of pentacles and the ten of wands so somebody is going to get a breakthrough um, somebody here is is going to get a breakthrough um, with the five of pentacles somebody's gonna right now somebody may be feeling left out in the cold there may be a distance between you both i also feel here that somebody feels that they're worried okay somebody may be worried somebody may be in a lot of tension okay but um with the ten of wands being here okay i feel that that is going to come to an end that is going to come to an end and a new cycle will begin um whether let's clarify the ten of wands um sorry i was thinking that's the ten of swords i don't know why i had the ten of swords in my mind it might be there for a collective amount of you you know um of leos um with the five pentacles um yeah there it is again i feel that somebody here is really stressed um somebody here with the five pentacles is being left out in the cold um i feel that somebody here may not be reciprocating the same amount of feelings here okay there, there may be a lot of responsibilities again from both ends clarify the ten of wands with the five of pentacles please we have the empress and the queen of pentacles there's that energy again and the same cards keep falling out um somebody is going to get a breakthrough though somebody is going to get a breakthrough with their person i feel that this ten of wands and the five of pentacles energy the stress that's coming is actually anxiety so somebody kind of stopped because they were nervous um, about what the answer will be or whether this person's going to say yes or no and i feel here that with the empress and the queen of pentacles being here you could be dealing like i said with the taurus virgo capricorn okay um but with the queen of pentacles here this person has a really grounded energy a really nurturing energy here okay and this person um has a lot of empathy and compassion okay um so i feel that there will be a breakthrough here okay let's go to your person leos why is the six of uh, swords here please why is the six of swords here please for the person in question angel guides so we have the ace of cups and we have the six of pentacles somebody here is really willing to somebody here has a lot of love leos somebody here has a lot of love okay i'm sorry about that guys um with the lighting um somebody here has a lot of love okay to give with the ace of cups this is abundance this is true love okay this is an overwhelming amount of emotions here okay and with the six of pentacles somebody here is ready to give and somebody's coming towards you in a calm in a calm situation they're trying to move out of that um to come towards you and offer you this cup of love whether that is you leo because you have that here or whether this is the person clarify the four of cups please angel guides you both have four of cups too i feel like you are both in the same situation a healing situation um, a transformation that's going on between you and this person and you're both healing each other <laughs> we have the empress and we have the star okay yeah this person is is healing this person while they are sitting there contemplating meditating they are healing they are healing okay they are grounding themselves they are trying to really um face their feelings okay and face their fears and they are healing okay they are spiritually healing 
okay and they're starting a brand new beginning here okay and they're thinking about it and they know okay that this is what they want this is their hopes their wishes this could be a dream come true okay let's clarify the ten of of wands clarify the ten of wands please angel guides okay we have the knight of wands we have the judgment and we have the hanged man so with these three cards i feel here that because of the stress and the burdens and the responsibilities that this person is carrying they want to make a move forward um in a very passionate manner but i think that they feel they may be making a very impulsive choice here or an impulsive decision okay and i think that with this judgment card they are making a decision as to whether they are moving too fast or whether they are moving too slow and with the hanged man i think that they are going to stop to reflect on the situation you see here with the hanged man they're going to stop here to reflect and i think they are going to you know um i think they're overwhelmed right now and they can't make a very clear decision and so any decision they make they may be feeling that they're moving too fast or impulsively or they may feel that you are moving too fast and impulsively um and i think with the hanged man being here as well i think that this is about them um you know trying to um they may even be trying to let go of all the stress that they have and these fears that are building up okay they may be going through like i said a transformation again um but i feel that they may be um trying to look at things from a different perspective okay clarify the ten of pentacles please and guards please clarify the ten of pentacles They have the five of wands in reverse so somebody here um in regards to family situations they may be dealing with children as well okay so if this person has children um they may be dealing with children okay and there may have been a lot of conflicts and tension that was caused and this person is now ready okay to avoid these conflicts okay they don't want to fight anymore okay and they know that this is a soulmate connection and i also feel that within themselves they're tired of fighting okay for a connection they are tired of fighting for for things that you know that no longer serve them well okay and they're trying to avoid it at all costs and with the six of cups being here i feel that with the six of cups they want to have this reunion okay you could be dealing with a past person you could be dealing with the mother or father of a child um it's not necessary but i do feel that for for most of you um leos and, and cross watchers this is an absolute new person okay that you have a new connection with okay that you may have been speaking to for quite a while let's clarify the the patience angel guys please clarify the temperance here please clarify the temperance i'm seeing a lot of fours of fives um in this breed we have the two of cups somebody here is trying to find balance in this connection they know that this is a twin flame soulmate connection the love is strong here the love is very strong but there is so many challenges and they want to take the risk they want to take the risk to start a new beginning clarify the five of swords please clarify the five of swords please angel guides whoa queen of swords and we also have the king of swords <laughs> you're both very conflicted and you both are very stubborn and you both want to win at any cost do you see that there you both want to win <laughs> this is um this is your person leo cross watchers right um let's see give me one more card please for the five of swords angel guys for the king of swords and the queen of swords we have the page of wands starting a new beginning having that adventure that passion between you both a very young energy okay um so what is working well for you and this person in question i feel here that with this person um you know that this person is the person that you love okay you know that this person um is everything that you wanted okay and you know that this person is your soulmate okay all right but with the messenger of swords being here okay i feel that this person is really mentally restless at the moment okay and i see that they have this they want to take the chance 
okay they want to let go of this they want to understand how they're feeling towards this connection but i feel that they may be finding it quite difficult at the moment um but i feel that they they want to have this balance they want to show how much they care they want to open up to this nurturing and loving kind of energy that they have here but they're guarding themselves up okay that's what i feel here um in the previous reading i did feel um leo and cross watchers that somebody here may have been having to choose between two people as well okay but that may be just for a collective amount of people um what is not working well okay so somebody here may be scared to take the risk okay somebody here may be um very very scared to take the risk somebody here is guarding themselves okay um i feel that they want to let go like i said but they're guarding themselves from this connection um i think once if they let go of this disconnect this if they open up their heart and acknowledge how they feel they'll be able to take the risk in and start a new beginning um the messenger of air sorry is is the knight of swords um with the knight of swords i feel like somebody here is ready to take action on this connection right so let's go in with your oracle cards okay so leo you have forgiveness stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste you create your reality by what you think dream and imagine so there it is letting go of your past and i feel that's you're both healing each other in this connection too my beloved though we may be physically apart spiritually always united for love time spends space and time and nothing is missing so there is that distance again between you and this person your person has time you are trying too hard give it time this person needs time to heal this person needs time to think close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful you can allow joy into your life regardless of the circumstances you currently find yourself in and that was the energy i was talking about is opening your heart to you know feeling and expressing and letting go of those emotions that you are holding on to okay your hard work is paying off so whoever here is trying to put the effort into this keep it going because it is working okay and this connection will work adjustments are required and there is again the balance that you both need in this relationship okay it's about meeting halfway okay i'm definitely seeing a potential of a very strong loving connection here leos and cross watchers um so i'm going to leave this reading here now leo's cross watchers i hope this resonated if it didn't it simply wasn't your message but i hope it was for uh, the majority of leo's and cross watchers because it is a very beautiful energy here um okay i'm going to leave this here um i wish you guys very well okay and i hope this resonated if it did don't forget to leave me like share and subscribe okay all the good stuff there and don't forget to stay safe and stay at home okay i love you guys take care Bye bye